Hi there, this evening I decided to set up my work stand and this is a work stand I bought from Lidl about two, three years ago and it cost me £30 so it's quite a cheap one but surprisingly pretty sturdy and robust um, it does fold away and has four legs so it's pretty stable uh, Fold it away, just flick, it, flick that little blue quick release handle open and pull it up, it, much like a tripod, a camera tripod. It has a tool tray, its height can be adjusted just by opening that quick release handle. You can adjust it up and down. There's the arm with the clamp on it which can be loosened and rotated as necessary. It's got this little bar you set up to stop the handlebars swinging around and hitting you in the head when you're working on a bike. The clamp will fit most cycle frames and it can be rotated to fit different shapes like suspension bikes for example. Um, it does have rubber inside there to protect the frame. So that's a quick, very quick overview of the stand I use. I'd recommend it, but not for like a bike shop use. This is more for home use, where you'd probably use it once in a blue moon. I wouldn't, really wouldn't recommend using it for a shop. You could, but I think the constant putting bikes in, taking them out and pulling the stand around, it probably wouldn't last very long. Anyway, I've set it up and put my bike in it because at the weekend, I hope, if I'm lucky, the parts I've ordered to finish this should arrive. They've apparently been posted today, according to eBay. So, if I'm lucky, by Saturday they should arrive. So I can uh, finish my project. And the parts I've ordered, as you know in a previous video, the chain, the freewheel, and the gear shifters. And I've also ordered a couple of meters of brake cable, outer casing, or outer cable, whatever you decide to call them. Some people call them outer cables, some people call them outer casing. Because I'll need some for the gears. When I buy the brake cables for this, they come with the outer casing as well. I can get some, but, uh, get my words out. I can buy a brake cable without the casing. But as I need the casings, I'm going to have to buy a pair of brake cables with the outer casing. I don't have any decent outer casings in stock, so I, I decided to uh, buy a two metre length on eBay while I was on eBay. That cost me three pound. I can't remember now without looking. Three pounds something. Free postage. So even if I have a bit left over, it'll be some left over for another project. Probably not a lot, but some at least. Anyway. I have got some pedals I can put on it for now and I have got a seat I can put on it for now that light on there is not staying on there I just got bored the other day and put it on there to see what it looked like it does work static flash off it's a cube rider Do I think it was from Sigma Sport yep it's a Sig from Sigma Sport Oddly enough, there was a big box of these taken to the local recycling centre a few years ago, and my friend, when he was working there, grabbed them. There was all sorts of bike bits in there. Mostly bike lights and cycle computers. I don't know what we've done with them between us over the years. Probably used them and broken them and lost them. And a lot of, I find a lot of modern bike lights don't last very long, but that's another video I can 
I can make another day. So I've got a big box full of bicycle loads under the bed. Yeah, I do keep my bike parts in weird places, but I do only live in a, in a um, apartment, so I don't have much space to use. So I have to optimise all the space I've got. I'm not sure if I'm going to keep this rear derailleur. Well, I do have others exactly the same as this, but they're all in roughly the same condition, so... Yeah, I'll leave it on there. There's no point taking it off, really, is the... I'll leave that on there. What are the wheels? That's a Pro Max hub. I don't know if you can hear that. A little bit of brake rub on that brake disc. I'll adjust that when I do the brakes. The front one's perfectly quiet. I've got Continental tyres on it. I believe I've mentioned in previous videos. So I'm just rambling now, as I normally do. I don't think there's much more I can say on the stand. I've only used that a handful of times, mostly because I do my work outside. And where I work outside, there isn't really the room to set this up without getting in the way of people walking in and out of the rear doors to the flats. So I just sit out there and do things the hard way. Or the harder way. Which is turn the bike upside down. Which can scuff up your handlebars if you don't put a rag or something down first. I usually save the stand for when I'm working up here. But I can be quite clumsy and drop my tools. And of course my neighbours below me hear the lump and that can get on their nerves sometimes. I don't like upsetting people so I do try to be respectful and try not to drop me tools. Especially as it's just gone 10.30 at night when I'm making this video. So I tend to stop anything that may cause something to lump on the floor, out of respect for my neighbours. <coughs> so, yeah, I really am looking forward to getting this bike done. In a way, that person who ever stole my bicycle, my lovely Gary Fisher, which I'm sure I've got a video of on my channel somewhere, has done me a favour in a, some sort of weird roundabout way. I do still miss my Gary Fisher bike though. It was a lovely bike to ride. Never mind, as they say, crap happens. So, I think Nemo likes being on camera because whenever I've got this out he appears. <laughs> Bless him. I love him to bits. Never get rid of him for any th for any reason. So yeah, I think I'll end the video. I've rambled on enough, and uh, the next video you'll see uploaded to my channel will hopefully be, if it's not another computer video. I've actually got another computer video to go after this one. Which I might put up before this one, I might not, I may save it until I've got the next video related to this bike done. We'll just have to wait and see. That's all I'll say, we'll wait and see. I'll decide closer to the time which ones to upload. Anyway, I'm going to end the video here, I've rambled on enough. If you liked the video, hit the like button. If you disliked it, hit the dislike button. Any comments? questions etc leave them in the comments section below and I'll talk to you again later.